Hello everyone out there in YouTube land. I'm the Scent Maven. Welcome back to my channel Shopping in Scents. And I'm bringing you another hand sanitizer warning recall video. This time it's Goose Creek hand sanitizer has been recalled. So I'm going to read you some information from the FDA website. And of course the only the only bottle of Goose Creek sanitizer that I own is on the recall list. So you might want to pay attention to this. So I will link this information down below. Sensational's Soaps and Candles has voluntarily expanded its April 27th recall of scented hand sanitizers to include three lots of Goose Creek hand sanitizer, NDC 75078-004 plus aloe and one lot of Coco TKO hand sanitizer in the 3.38 and 3.4 fluid ounce spray bottles, respectively, to the consumer level. These products are listed in the table below, which I'm going to read you. These products are being recalled after being tested, uh, after testing conducted by our firm. This is an announcement from the company. This is an announcement from Sensational Soap and Candles that produced this for Goose Creek. On the, uh, this is printed on the FDA website. These products are being recalled after testing conducted by our firm revealed the presence of methanol, wood alcohol, benzene, and acetylide. These products were sold on the internet. Guess where I got this? And distributed nationwide in the USA by Goose Creek Candles, LLC, and Coconut Stand. So what is what are the risks? Well, let's go to what sanitizers were recalled. So the lot number on the side of the bottle near the base. I don't see any lot number on the side of this bottle near the base. Ah, here. Well, unfortunately for me, my lot number is faded off. I can't read it. So I don't know. But I will read to you. So, uh, Goose Creek Hand Sanitizer Plus Aloe in the sense Blueberry Limeade Antibacterial Spray, Limoncello, Beach Dreams, Grape Soda, Champagne Bubbles, Dragon Fruit Splash, Marshmallow, Melon Picnic, Optimistic Vibes, Red, White, and Blue, Water Lemonade, Tropical Daydream, and then there's the one by Coco TKO Hand Sanitizer Coconut Stand. So, okay. The Blueberry Limeade, so pay attention here if you're not going to read this article. Blueberry Limeade, Limoncello, Beach Dreams, Grape Soda, Champagne Bubbles, Dragon Fruit Splash, marshmallows are all lot number 20258 and they are the 3.38 fluid ounces melon picnic optimistic vibes red white and blue watermelon lemonade are lot number 20259 in the 3.83 no 3.38 fluid ounces and the tropical daydream is lot number 20260 3.38 fluid ounces so for me red white and blue 20259 i Yep, this is 20259. 
This is 20259. I can read it. So I officially have been using, use that much, of the recalled Goose Creek hand sanitizer in red, white, and blue. That is scary. Now, I'm going to read you what the possible side effects are. And then I'm going to call Goose Creek. Uh, risk statement. So, this product, according to Sensational Soaps and Candles, which tested the products listed in the table, which I just read you, said that the products are being recalled after testing conducted by our firm revealed the presence of methanol, wood alcohol, benzene, and acetylide. Okay, risk statement. Substantial methanol exposure can result in nausea, vomiting, headache, blurred vision, permanent blindness, seizures, coma, permanent damage to the nervous system, or death. Although all persons using these products on their hands are at risk, young children who accidentally ingest the products and adolescents and adults who drink the products uh, as an alcohol su ethanol substitute are most at risk for methanol poisoning. Exposure to benzene can occur through inhalation, oral, and skin. There is a reasonable, pro reasonable probability that benzene present at levels above the maximum daily exposure recommendations can result in cancers, including leukemia and blood cancer of the bone marrow and blood disorders, which can be life-threatening. Additionally, animal studies have shown that acetylide can possibly can cause cancer in humans. To date, the company has not received any reports of adverse reactions related to this recall. Let's see. Uh, these products are used as hand sanitizers and marketed to help decrease bacteria on skin when soap and water are not available. The affected bottles of hand sanitizer include a five digit lot code printed on the bottle near the base. The products can be identified by the label, scent, and lot code provided in the table at the end of this release, which I just read you. Uh, the, let's see, photos are also provided at sensationalproducts.com. Sensational Soaps and Candles Inc. has notified its direct customers by telephone with confirmatory email and ask that they remove the recalled products from commerce immediately if they still have any in uh, inventory. Consumers, distributors, and retailers that have the hand, sanitizers, hand sanitizers which are being recalled should stop using, distributing, or selling them and return them to the place of purchase. Okay. Consumers with questions regarding this recall can contact our consumer support desk at 1-855-554- 8050 Monday to Friday during business hours 9 to 5. Consumers should contact their physician or healthcare provider if they have experienced problems that may be related to taking or using this product. Adverse reactions or quality problems experienced with the use of this product may be reported to the FDA's MedWatch Adverse Event Reporting Program, either online or by fax. Okay, and then. This recall is being conducted with the knowledge of the U.S. Food and Drug Administration. We have discontinued all hand sanitizer products, said Steve Morrison of Sensational Soaps and Candles, Inc. We work very hard every day to carefully procure the highest quality ingredients, and we sincerely regret any inconvenience this recall may cause. And let me see if my picture of the red, white, and blue is up there with all these other pictures. Yes, it is. So, another reason to love Goose Creek. I will be making a call to Goose Creek. I don't think they are open now. Let me see. Let me see if Goose Creek is still selling sanitizer on its site. Goose Creek. And the, the ironic thing is they just 
started doing these promos. Uh, I've seen them on Facebook where they say that their ingredients are made in Italy. Their products are made in Italy and they have such great pure fresh ingredients and all this other stuff. Let me see if you can still buy hand sanitizer on the Goose Creek website. I see, when I type in hand sanitizer, I see soap. I don't see any sanitizer on the Goose Creek website. Let's see categories. Let's see if um, red, white, and blue is on here. It's a lot of scents. Let me just type in, let's see, body care. Body care. Soap shower gel, body lotion, all body care products, lush hand cream. I don't see any hand sanitizer on their website anymore. There's seven pages worth of stuff. I think I'm just going to have to call Goose Creek and see what they have to say. So let's see, customer service, contact us. Is it going to be 24 hours a day or Monday through Friday? Let's see. Monday through Friday, 10 a.m. to 4 p.m. So I will have to call Goose Creek and do a follow-up on what their response is to their recalled sanitizer. I will link the FDA article down below. I hope this was informative and helpful to you. Uh, remember to comment, read, subscribe, follow me on Instagram at Shopping and Sense, and I will see you all in a future video. But until then, goodbye everyone out there in YouTube land.